Hello, my name is Deborah Lewis. Welcome to the Jane Schaefer Writing Program's support video series. In this series, national trainers will provide you with a step-by-step -step review of the response to literature mode of writing. So why choose Jane Schaefer as your writing program? Writing is a process, but it's a thinking process. And we teach the thinking that goes with writing because students need to be able to formulate and communicate new learning effectively. Jane's vision was all students can think, all students can write. To Jane, that vision transcended cognitive abilities, grade levels, language development, and socioeconomic backgrounds. In order to achieve the vision, Jane's program relies on teachers who understand the importance of using common terminology. Common terminology across grade levels and content areas allows students to connect writing as an integral form of communicating one's learning. The graphic organizers. When used with consistency, these tools guide students through the questioning process that fuels critical thinking. Color coding focuses that critical thinking on the elements of academic writing necessary to present a logical presentation of knowledge. And when teachers confer with both individual students and small groups, students realize the uniqueness of their own voice and contribution to learning. This first segment is designed to provide an overview of teaching the process of one of the most widely assigned modes of discourse, response to literature, also known as literary analysis. We begin teaching the process by making sure students realize the importance of understanding a writing prompt. Students must know their task. We call this skill decoding the prompt. Once students understand their teacher's expectations, the next step in the sequence is for students to read a text closely and process the information through annotation. To organize that information processing, students identify specific, relevant, and appropriate evidence and make inferences about that evidence on the graphic organizer known as gathering CDs and CMs. The T-chart's purpose is to narrow the focus of the task by developing a topic sentence and arranging the decisions made from the previous graphic organizer. The skill of generating commentary, also known as analysis, is perhaps the most challenging as well as the most rewarding skill for all writers to learn. Jane's wow chart is the path to analytical success through critical thinking and vocabulary development. The paragraph ends with students developing a concluding sentence. Students learn how to web off the topic sentence to compose an effective closing to a strong paragraph. Once a writer develops a first draft body paragraph, the next step is to move and improve the writing to the shaping sheet. Here, the concentration is on editing, revising, and proofing. Students learn, practice and improve their grammar skills, sentence structure, and fluency. Each step in the process is one step closer to the final draft. When students are ready to write multi-paragraph essays, they learn to start with an introduction, which serves as a roadmap to the entire essay. For developing writers, the most important sentence in the introduction is the thesis statement. So we begin with that sentence and its graphic organizer. Students then learn to develop an introduction, a thoughtful opening to the essay. 
And finally, students learn to develop a conclusion, giving a finished feeling to their essay. As you can see, there is a difference between assigning writing and teaching writing. Each step in the process focuses on the thinking skills necessary for students to be able to formulate and communicate learning. This video series will continue with a review of each step in the JSWP response to literature writing process that we touched on in this overview. At the end of the series, we will provide a video of the JSWP scope and sequence designed to create an awareness of how to plan the instruction of writing to meet your students' needs. We thank you for joining us in Jane's vision that all students can think, all students can write.